Yates, and I'm a junior. I'm Chris Keenan, I'm a junior. I'm Kelsey Hanna, and I'm a sophomore. And we go to Scott Catholic. And this poem is titled, Reflections. Reflections. A poem for peace. Thousands, Thousands of years, years ago, ago, they say, a hunter fell in love with his reflection. Unable to tear himself away from the edge of the shimmering pool, he clutched at the soil until it fell away under his fingers, not realizing the face gazing back was only an image, till it was too late. These days, I struggle to recognize my reflection, who I am and this conflict with who I want to be, what I want to leave behind. The water's surface is calm. In silhouette, my edges are sharp. But the specters in my head with their delusions of courage make ripples that push my face apart with icy fingers, trace the condensation on my glass at the family dinner table, and then someone says, the Muslims, the Muslims are, are just getting, getting what they, they had coming. coming. I hear the words. The fire comes up inside me, burns the walls of my throat like bile, and I breathe it into my napkin because I know opening my mouth will just make burn marks on the white tablecloth instead of change. In the sunlight, I speak schoolyard speeches about standing up. A call to make more than just a ripple in our pond. To swirl our fingers in the current till it becomes a thunderstorm made by the sound of our footsteps on the march. But when it rains, I drive home from school. Keep my eyes on the speedometer at the stoplight corner. Will it to pull me away quickly? Over the glass seconds when I roll too, too close, close to a damp cardboard sign and the rattling ice beside it. When did every stop sign moment become a negotiation between the foreign powers in my brain? If I let my fear and fire escape, I risk destroying the fragile balance that keeps diplomats polite. I tell myself weighing the hope and pain of those who are hurting. Against easy ignorance, against family, against my own safety is a choice I don't know how to make. But suddenly there's an alien in the mirror. Watch, Watch myself, myself become, become what I thought I was fighting. How did I become my own worst role model? Whoever painted this picture on the glass didn't even bother to make my eyes the same color. Open the dictionary, find the Greek word narcissist. To look, look in the mirror. To be numb. I switch off the lights and try to make out my peoples and the glow from the crack under the door. Maybe, Maybe if I encounter myself by chance in this mirror of darkness and touch something more than just a painting on its cool surface, I'll learn to negotiate the war inside myself. Maybe this isn't settling. Maybe I don't have to fight every fight with 17-year-old fists. Instead, I'll win by acts of kindness. Introduce myself with a smile. And an outstretched hand. Start building bridges instead of setting everything aflame so someday they can write peace on my gravestone after I evaporate.